Elon Musk just revealed the terrifying truth about CERN. In recent years, there have been a lot of conspiracy theories in the world of science. The European Organization for Nuclear Research, or CERN, has caught the attention of many people. With its big ideas and groundbreaking discoveries, CERN has become a place where rumors and wild claims can grow. One of these claims is that Elon Musk, the CEO of SpaceX and Tesla, and a visionary businessman has told a scary truth about CERN. In this video, we'll look at what CERN is really like, separate fact from fiction, and find out the truth behind the conspiracy theories that have grown up around this famous scientific organization. CERN is a European research organization that has been around since 1954. It runs the biggest particle physics lab in the world. Its main goal is to find out what the basic rules of the universe are by looking at the particles that make up matter and the forces that control them. Near Geneva, Switzerland, CERN is home to the Large Hadron Collider, or LHC, which is a huge underground particle accelerator that speeds up particles to almost the speed of light before they crash into each other. Scientists can watch and study the basic building blocks of matter in high-energy situations caused by these collisions. Elon Musk, who is known for his work on electric cars, renewable energy, and space travel, has said more than once that he is interested in science. Even though he hasn't said anything official about CERN, it's clear that he wants to advance scientific knowledge. Musk has talked about how important it is to do research and development in different scientific fields to help people and solve problems. But more research is needed before we can say that Elon Musk said a certain scary thing about CERN. Some conspiracy theories about CERN involve the end of the world, while others say that black holes and portals to other dimensions are being used in secret experiments. Most of the time, these theories have nothing to do with science. Instead, they are based on misunderstandings, wrong interpretations, and fear of the unknown. Black Holes and the LHC One of the most popular conspiracy theories says that the LHC at CERN could make tiny black holes that could swallow the Earth. This claim is based on a misunderstanding of what black holes are and how CERN keeps people safe. The energy levels that can be reached in the LHC are much lower than what is needed to make stable black holes. Also, scientists at CERN have done a lot of research on safety and have found no major risks to Earth or its people. Portals and Traveling to Other Dimensions Another conspiracy theory says that CERN is trying out portals to other dimensions or parallel universes. Theoretical physics looks into the idea of multiple dimensions, but the idea that CERN could open portals to other worlds is just a guess. The main goal of CERN's research is to figure out what particles are made of and interdimensional travel is a very different topic. CERN hasn't been up to anything bad. Instead, it has made a lot of important contributions to science and technology. The discovery of the Higgs boson in 2012 is one of the most important things in particle physics. It proved the existence of the Higgs field and gave scientists clues about where mass comes from. This important discovery opened the door to more research and helped us learn more about the universe. CERN also encourages international cooperation by bringing scientists from all over the world together to work on experiments that are on the cutting edge. Its open access policy and commitment to sharing data have led to a global exchange of knowledge and collaboration that is good for the scientific community as a whole. In this age of social media and too much information, it is important to be skeptical of conspiracy theories and only trust information from reliable sources. It's normal to be interested in shocking claims, but it's also important to question whether or not they are true and look for evidence-based explanations. When looking at claims about CERN or any other scientific institution, it is important to look at the scientific community's expertise and consensus. The work done at CERN is not done in a vacuum. It is closely looked at by many scientists, researchers, and peer-reviewed publications. Scientific discoveries are based on evidence, being able to repeat the experiment and the work of many experts in the field. Conspiracy theories often gain support by taking advantage of the fact that we don't fully understand complex scientific ideas. The unknowns of particle physics and the huge size of the experiments done at CERN can make it easy for false ideas to spread. But these mysteries can be solved through scientific research, collaboration, and careful experimentation. It's important to know that CERN works with the public to address concerns, increase transparency, and clear up misunderstandings. The organization offers educational materials, talks to the public, and chances for people to learn more about particle physics firsthand. CERN tries to bridge the gap between scientific research and public understanding by encouraging open dialogue and sharing knowledge. 
The spread of conspiracy theories not only hurts the credibility of scientific institutions, but it also makes it harder for people to make decisions based on good information. In a time when false information can spread quickly and widely, it is important to be able to think critically and tell the difference between fact and fiction. Education is a key part of fighting the power of conspiracy theories. Promoting scientific literacy and a basic understanding of the scientific method can give people the tools they need to evaluate claims in an objective way and see how important it is to base their arguments on evidence. We can make a society that values rationality and evidence by encouraging scientific inquiry and curiosity. Also, media literacy is important for making sense of the huge amount of information we have access to. It is important to question the sources of information, think about how reliable they are, and figure out if claims are backed up by good evidence. In this case, organizations that check the facts and reputable scientific journals are very helpful. By checking facts before we accept them as true, we can avoid falling for sensationalism and rumors with no basis. When it comes to CERN, it's important to realize how much this scientific organization has helped us learn about the universe. From fighting the Higgs boson to getting scientists from different countries to work together, CERN is a great example of how human creativity and international cooperation can help advance knowledge. We can make conspiracy theories less appealing by focusing on the real things that organizations like CERN have done and how they've helped people. At its core, science is the search for truth, which is done through careful research and the constant improvement of our understanding. It is a process that works best when scientists are skeptical, review each other's work, and work together as a group. As we learn more about conspiracy theories about CERN, it's important to remember that these ideas aren't just limited to this scientific organization. Throughout history, skepticism and conspiracy theories have been used to explain away scientific progress and difficult tasks. There have been rumors and false claims about a lot of things like the Apollo moon landing, vaccination programs, and climate change, to name a few. People are often drawn to conspiracy theories because they are afraid, uncertain, or want simple explanations for things that are hard to understand. They give you a sense of control and understanding in a world that can sometimes feel chaotic and unpredictable. But it's important to look at these theories with reason and skepticism, since there is a lot of scientific evidence and consensus among experts that they are wrong. Scientific breakthroughs and discoveries like those made at CERN are put through a lot of testing, replication, and peer review. This process makes sure that the results are not based on personal preferences or hidden goals, but rather on objective evidence and good scientific methods. Scientists spend their whole lives trying to find the truth and learn more about the universe. Their work is guided by the ideas of intellectual honesty and openness. Conspiracy theories can also happen in the real world. They can make people lose faith in scientific institutions, which makes people less likely to accept scientific consensus on important issues like climate change or vaccinations. This can have big effects on public health, taking care of the environment, and making policy. It is important to tell the difference between a healthy dose of skepticism and a belief in a conspiracy. Skepticism is a key part of the scientific method, so science encourages it. Scientists are always questioning and challenging existing theories to help us learn more about the world. But healthy skepticism is based on facts and is open to being challenged and changed as new information comes out. On the other hand, conspiracy theories often base their claims on cherry-picked data, logical fallacies, and ignoring overwhelming evidence. In the end, claims that Elon Musk told a scary truth about CERN should be treated with skepticism and a commitment to evidence-based reasoning. Even though conspiracy theories are interesting, they're often not based on science and can hurt how people understand things and make decisions. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more captivating scientific journeys. And as always, leave your thoughts and comments down below, and we'll see you on our next adventure.